Now, as state capitals are preparing for those protests, lawmakers are back at the South Carolina State House for the beginning of the 2021 legislative session. And that's where we find our Jason Raven. So, Jason, you spoke with leadership about priorities this year. What are some of the big things on the agenda? Well, Diane, their plates are going to be full this year. They wanted to tackle some things last year, but they're hoping to tackle things like the COVID-19 pandemic, a new state budget, and the future of Santee Cooper. And most importantly, they want to do it all safely. Masked South Carolina lawmakers got back to work after the COVID-19 pandemic shortened their legislative session last year. Now, leadership say they hope to address the pandemic right away. Most importantly, the vaccine rollout. We are having some real problems right now with vaccinations and getting those into arms. We've got vaccinations. We just don't have uh, people getting vaccinated at a fast enough rate. Now, Senate Minority Leader Brad Hutto of Orangeburg County says slowing the spread of the disease until more people are vaccinated is very important to Senate Democrats. He also says the budget will be used to address financial issues caused by the pandemic. We've got a fair amount of one-time money that we're going to have to distribute, and we need to look at the priorities in light of the pandemic. The Senate Republicans increased their majority in the body. Majority Leader Shane Massey of Edgefield County says the pandemic will be a big focus for the Senate this year. Now, a Senate Medical Affairs Committee received a briefing from DHEC this afternoon. Important for us to understand what's going on because the public is calling us about those things. And it's important that we be able to communicate uh, th those things. So you're going to see some focus on that. You'll see some focus on education. And over in the House, Minority Leader Todd Rutherford says he's looking forward to get to work, but wants to make sure they can serve the people of South Carolina safely. We bring people from all around this state to come to this chamber, which we've done for centuries. It's what we are delegated to do. However, in doing so in 2021, we have to make sure that what we're not doing is spreading disease back across the state. Now, he says he expects Santee Cooper, a potential hate crime bill, and police reform to be some of the first things taken up in the House. Now, House Republican leadership were not available for comment to talk about their priorities today. Ben and Diane talking about safety. We saw an increased presence of law enforcement inside the state house today. Multiple state agencies were there. Now, we also heard that Columbia police are keeping a close eye on the area surrounding the state house leading up into inauguration day. Live downtown Columbia, Jason Raven, 7 News. Thank you, Jason. Now, tomorrow, Governor Henry McMaster will be holding his State of the State address and lay out his priorities for the General Assembly this year.